So this is a DIY tire bead breaker. I've currently assembled it enough so that it moves. There's two holes here for two positions. This is the arm, it's about 48 inches long. This tire is here just to see kind of the general size. And this is currently clamped, but I'll put a couple holes here on the side so that something like this can push down against the plate on the edge of the tire and break the bead. So we welded the base on and now we're going to weld this top part on. We're going to weld the base a little bit more now that the top part is welded. the progress of the bead breaker so far we bent this piece in the vise that goes on the tire itself we'll have to cut here a little bit so that it doesn't poke the tire if we know the right arrangement of knots hitches and more you can hold just about anything up with any rope that's how this handle is floating in position i have this wood here so that it keeps these angle iron straight while this bottom piece is clamped, I don't think it's focusing right now, sorry about that. But we will weld this and cut it, and then I'll show you the final product, and then I'll just do a quick test, not actually doing something. We just finished making this piece. It has three holes for three different positions. Here I had to fill some gaps. I know it's not the best and I purposely didn't fill that. We're waiting for this to cool down before we can install it. But this basically just pushes down on the tire to break the bead. The bead breaker is done. There's two positions here, three positions here, and two positions here. And that should be enough for every small to medium tire bead breaking. I have a Discord server link is in the description. Please subscribe.